Opening today, the Tropical Breeze Casino boat reopens for business. This is the first time since a weekend shuttle fire that sent passengers dumping into the water for safety. And we're also hearing dramatic 911 calls now from the passengers. News Channel 8's Meredith Sensulo explains the changes the casino has now implemented. The Tropical Breeze Casino reopens for business today at 3.30. A representative for the company tells News Channel 8 that instead of using a shuttle into international waters, the casino boat will pick up passengers. That following Saturday's shuttle that went up in flames. There's a giant boat on fire. People are jumping out. It looks like it, but the boat's going to blow and there's still people in the water. It's completely on fire. We're all jumping overboard. Those calls flooded 911 Saturday from terrified passengers and witnesses to the shuttle boat fire. 15 passengers jumped into cold water. One woman later passed away. The Coast Guard continues to investigate the fire, but tells News Channel 8 it has no restrictions on Tropical Breeze reopening. The Coast Guard does an awesome job. They have a lot of restrictions, a lot of rules in place, uh, and they keep us accountable by doing uh, annual inspections. And anytime there's an incident, they come out and do random inspections. The tropical breeze will operate on a modified schedule for the next several days, according to the company's Facebook page. One of the men injured when he jumped from the shuttle boat fire tells News Channel 8 that Tropical Breeze is covering the medical bills from passengers involved in the boat disaster. Anyone on the shuttle should contact the company to submit their medical bills. Back to you.